How's it going, Rogue Scowler, and welcome to another Flesh and Blood video. Today, we have a very exciting video because we have the announcements for the very first calling events here in the United States, and oh man, I cannot be more excited for these. This is... This is a huge deal for both like the flesh and blood scene, the competitive scene for the United States in general. Um, yeah, I'm really, really excited for that. And what I mean for the United States in general, I just mean in terms of you know events and that kind of stuff because these are going to be in-person events later this year. There's gonna be four of them and we'll talk about that in a little bit more detail as we go on in the video. There's not a lot of details about them right now um, because it hasn't been officially announced. By the time that this video goes live, they will have been officially announced and there will be all of that information up on the Channel Fireball um, Twitter page, I believe. And there'll probably be some sort of post by Legend Story Studios as well. So yeah, let's start talking about this. I'm really, really excited. This is something that personally I will be attending. So if you wanted to actually meet me and maybe some other content creators in person, I will be attending at least one of these, maybe two of these. So what are calling events and why are they so exciting? Well, calling events are kind of like old Magic Grand Prix or Magic Fests where it's kind of like a big convention, but there's also a you know large tournament with a really big cash prize. There's like side events. There's probably gonna be some vendors, maybe some artists, maybe some other people throughout the Flesh and Blood community like yours truly. Um, and they're just kind of like an awesome way to get together and to play in the flesh and blood, to meet people, to maybe meet some people from Legend Story Studios. And dude, I cannot be uh, more excited for these. It's also, you know, where the competitive players can really like strut their stuff, where they can prove that they're the best in the region. And that is also very exciting. I will be competing in these. Um, I, don't, <laughs> I don't plan on doing super well, but I'm not bad at flesh and blood, so. We'll see, I'm gonna do a lot of practice. I used to compete in competitive magic events. I used to play in the uh, the Junior Super Series and the Super Series, and I did pretty good in some of those events. Um, I got top 10 in some of them, so I'm gonna put in some work. I'm gonna start grinding some flesh and blood, and I'm gonna try to get there, man. And man, this is just, this is actually incredibly huge. You know, a lot of pro magic players could also turn to flesh and blood during this time, so we might see an influx of new players wanting to get into flesh and blood to compete in competitive events. Like, this is a this is a really big deal. Organized play is a very, very important thing for trading card games, and I think flesh and blood is gonna stand as like a, a high example of what, um, you know, organized play can be. Even though they're kind of going like a, with a traditional organized play model, I think it's super important. And these calling events are kind of the first step to, you know, really achieving that here in the United States. I know there's been calling events in like New Zealand and, and some other places, but this is gonna be the first place in the US, or the first true time in the US uh, where we can do this. And there might've been a couple like way back when, but these are gonna be like the first ones in a long time. Okay, so let's get into some of the details. Who is gonna be like hosting these and running these? I'm pretty sure it's gonna be Channel Fireball. And by pretty sure, I mean like very, very sure, 99.99% sure this is gonna be run by Channel Fireball and that makes a lot of sense. Channel Fireball used to host magic events. Um, they also have a partnership with Legend Story Studios. And I, I know I, I make content for Channel Fireball about Flesh and Blood. It just makes a lot of sense. And Channel Fireball is one of like the premier um, US like game convention host kind of things. They, 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 they're one of the premier ones. So that makes a lot of sense. I don't know, like I said, I don't know the full details. I don't know if all of these are gonna be Channel Fireball, but I do know a lot of the details are gonna be from Channel Fireball. So I would assume most of them, if not all of them, are gonna be from Channel Fireball. There's gonna be four events. I personally plan on attending one of them, like almost 100%, and then probably two of them. We'll, we'll see about that, that second one, but Man, I'm really excited. So what cities are these gonna be in? There's kind of a bummer for me personally because none of them are in the Pacific Northwest. I was really hoping for like a Portland or a Seattle one, but um, I'm gonna have to fly. So that's fine, that's fine. But uh, um, yeah, so let's talk about which ones they are. Okay, I pulled up my, my phone just so I can get the details right. Um, so the lineup is gonna be Las Vegas, Cincinnati, Dallas, Fort Worth, and Orlando. And um, it's gonna be between September and November of this year. I don't really know the details right now, but I do know probably that the first three um, 
Las Vegas, Cincinnati, and Dallas-Fort Worth are going to be classic constructed events, like for the main events. And then Orlando is going to be Kingdoms Sealed, which is super spicy and super awesome. I personally am going to attend the Dallas-Fort Worth event. There's some other content creators who will probably, almost certainly also be attending that one, namely DM Armada. He and I will probably both be there. And he and I also might be at the Orlando event. That's the other one that I really want to attend because, man, Sealed? I love Sealed. I love Limited. I love Sealed. And Kingdom Sealed is going to be so cool. Brand new set Sealed. Uh, Wide-eyed. Everyone's like bright-eyed and bushy tail. It's going to be awesome, man. I'm really, really looking forward to this. And I'm going to kind of read a little bit of like the official blurb. It says, The Calling is a 3D event coming to cities throughout the United States that celebrates all things flesh and blood. It's time to test your mettle against other flesh and blood players and come together to share your passion for flesh and blood and everything that makes it special. With exclusive promos, play mats, $10,000 in prize money, tons of side events, and all things flesh and blood, you won't want to miss out. Dude, I'm not going to miss out. I hope you guys don't. I either hope to see a lot of you there at some of these events. Like I said, I will be attending the Dallas-Fort Worth event as well as the, well, hopefully the Orlando event. I would really like to do that. Closest to me is probably gonna be the Las Vegas event, but I would really wanna to go to the Dallas-Fort Worth one because there's already people in the area that I know and I really wanna you know, meet some of these people in real life. That's one of the best parts about Flesh and Blood, man, and card games, coming together and meeting you know, these people and playing in the Flesh and Blood and once again, I also want to, you know, travel with some of these people to the Orlando event and kind of make like a little vacation out of it later this year. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of this and if you uh, want to or plan on attending any of these calling events. Dude, it's going to be so sweet. It's going to be so sweet. Like I said, it's just a great time to like connect with people, to play some flesh and blood, to, you know, just kind of like talk in person. The whole like pandemic has been such a downer and like I know that like these events are going to be in-person events and it's going to be a little probably but probably a little touch and go with like covid and everything but um i really have hope that things are going to be under wraps by them most people will be vaccinated all that kind of stuff and it's not going to be really be really a problem i really don't know about that by the way like what they're going to do with like if you have to have your vaccinations or proof of it or, or whatever i really don't know about any of that kind of stuff um just rest assured that i've already kind of like taken care of myself so um personally I'm, I'm, I'm good to go. I really want to attend some events, so I made sure to, to get, get that stuff done. And a quick shout out to Channel Fireball for hosting these events. You know, I, I truly believe in these games and I love people who support them like Channel Fireball and local game stores and content creators and everyone out there who supports Flesh and Blood. Um, if you would like to buy anything from Channel Fireball, I do have a personal affiliate link. If you want to type in Rogue at checkout or use my affiliate link in the description down below. Also in the description down below, there should be links to all of the stuff that I said um, to if a Legend Story Studios posted... Um, you know, a blog about it should have that down in the description as well as if um, a channel fireball tweeted about it or posted on the website or whatever i should have links to all that stuff in the description down below so you can read this firsthand but man this is such an exciting time um i don't think i'm gonna be winning any of these events but that's not what it's all about for me right it'd be sweet to win and to get some cash you know some prizes and stuff but just going there competing and meeting people and just having an awesome like flesh and blood experience is is, is what where it's at i don't really know what classes i'm going to be playing um, i know flesh and blood does stuff like the top ranked azalea player in events gets like a prize and stuff the top ranked viscerai player so you know there's some strategy there like maybe if i don't think i can win the whole thing maybe i could be like the best azalea player or something i don't know it's class constructed so probably not azalea but Hmm, maybe Viscerai or something. I don't know. I don't know. I'm really, really excited for this. So thank you so much for watching. If you'd like to support me directly, like I said, you can use any of those affiliate links or you can check out my um, Patreon where we have like a community discord and we talk about, you know, deck strategy, all this kind of stuff. We're definitely going to be talking about these calling events coming up. So if you'd like to join that, check out my Patreon and, and all that kind of stuff. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. This is such an exciting time for Flesh and Blood. Tomorrow's video is um, recorded a little while ago, but I think it fits really well with what we're talking about here because I think it's just the beginning, just the beginning for Flesh and Blood. And this is kind of like one of the hallmark moments, you know, this is like a, a, a good moment in history to, to remember and to be here for. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time for some more Flesh and Blood content. Have a good one all. We'll see you later.